the lack of experience I had didn't stop me from, you know, learning, having a good experience, and learning uh, vector design and creating some work that I'm really proud of. Uh, one, of the, one of those works would be uh, the company logo I made, which, um, which I'm particularly proud of because uh, it was, I was able to use uh, some new some techniques that I just learned in it, like uh, Boolean operations. Yeah, it'd be fun to pursue this in college. Maybe I was even thinking about taking courses at uh, make Strike in Cabrillo just before I graduate to further my knowledge in this area. And I probably want to take classes in college. I learned everything from the ground up. As I had never used the Blender before, I had to learn how to control the program and I had to learn how to manipulate the camera and manipulate the object and the thing I was creating. I like that I have this new skill that I didn't have before and I'm able just to create these things on the computer which, were, um, which I wouldn't think I'd be able to do before. I had no previous knowledge of digital design before this class, but that didn't stop me from succeeding in like designing really good work. Like for example, I made a solar system that challenged me to like not only know the technology technology we use, but it challenged me to like know how to make a solar system and implement that into um, the three D blender. My favorite project was the wrecking ball because not only did the chain swing, but the individual chain links were moving on their own, which I thought was awesome because it was very different from what I've ever done before with animation. Game Maker taught me a lot about troubleshooting abilities in the beginning when we first had to make our characters go from room to room. Pretty much everyone was having trouble connecting them and we realized that after copious amounts of time that we really needed to make sure that our rooms were in the correct positions next to each other. I made multiple sprites, for example I made a police, which is my enemy. It's kind of funny the way he acts because he just runs around. I also made different kinds of minions, but you have to get to farther levels in order to see them. And I really enjoyed making the sprites because I like making them really detailed and I'm proud of what I've done. When I go to college in the fall, I was hoping to take coding classes because I really like it. It makes me feel good about myself when I like type in the code and then it, you know, puts this really cool thing that I made on the screen and I think it's it's definitely for people that enjoy a challenge, but it feels really really good when you're able to overcome the challenge and I think it's really fun and I hope that one day I can teach other people who don't know about coding how to code because it's so important and honestly the only limit to coding is your own creativity. It was absolutely fun. I recommend it to anyone who enjoys technology. Yeah, definitely. It's a really fun class and I'm sure you guys will enjoy it.
Yes, it was very fun, and it was fun learning how to do it. And it's also cool to be able to put, you know, put what you learn into use. And I do recommend it. Yeah, it was really fun. I'd recommend it to anyone who has a good imagination. You get to do so many cool educational things, and what you're doing is so fun that you don't even remember that it's education. It's just.